And did you know that we have a free Revit community where you can enjoy and participate in discussions as this one is, for example, so you don't need to be our paid student to be able to discuss and to learn something from here. And also, next to free Revit community, we also have a free Revit training where you can enjoy over 9 hours of content as well as project files and that can for sure help you to level up your Revit skills. It's totally free to join our community and you can find the link in a video description. I've got this question from one of the students in my community. And as you can see, the problem here is that he would like to change the text size of the section because in 1 to 25 scale, the section number 2 is showing very small. So let's see. And as you can see, this is the number 2 of the section. So he's referring to the text. And then you can see the text of Dimension Style is quite bigger. And I have that in Revit directly. So it's not about the text, it's actually about the tag label. So when you select your section, and when you go to edit type, you will see which tag we are using for a section. So this section had arrow, just click here, and then we are going to see what do we use for a section head and section tail. So we use this section head fill arrow. And when you go to project browser here to the search, and when we type section arrow, you will see here that we have this section head fill, filled arrow. So do the double click on that one and then just go to edit. So here you see this letter E. And by the way, we have the text here in inches. I'm not familiar with inches. So what I'm going to do, I will just go to manage and I'm going to change the length to, to millimeters. So let's see, when I select this level and when I go to edit type for this level, you see that the text size is 2.3 millimeters. So for example, if I would like to make it or just to duplicate this one and to make it four and then type four millimeters, it became big this much. So four millimeters then just go here, load back into the project, override. And then you see that suddenly it became bigger and now it's four millimeters. And when I select this dimension, so when I go to dimension, you will see that the measure has text size of 2.4. So this is way bigger than it was before. So it's not about the text. It's all about the tag level and the size of the tag level. And if you would like to understand how the tags works, you will need to also understand how shared parameters works. And to master shared parameters, just watch this tutorial.